What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough. Okay, so what's up guys? It's time. It is time to go capture Mewtwo, and uh, if you guys remember from the last episode, I used up the Master Ball for Suicune. So, we're going all in on this one right here. We got a team to try and capture Mewtwo. We got Sir Razor finally evolved into a Victory Bell. We got a uh, Tyranitar that we named Nightmare. And uh, we got Dragonite named Drago, of course. You know, if I had the Dragonite on my team, it would be named Drago. And we got Tank and then, you know, Zapdos just for, you know, a little, a little backup. Just in case that whole sleep thing doesn't work. Because trust me, guys, freaking Mewtwo is going to be hard. Super hard. I'm almost tempted to just quit right here, but you know what? It is what it is. So, let's go straight to the Cerulean Cave. Now, what you need to do is you need to defeat the Elite Four in order to get there. Now, I could be wrong in Leaf Green because I never tried to capture Mewtwo, uh... I never tried to capture Mewtwo, uh, like, right after the Elite Four. I just went straight to the Sevi Islands, uh, every single time, or... I think I did, but I'm just, like, too... Like, too fuzzy on that. So, we're gonna be going straight, and, uh... Yeah, I, I nor actually, I normally captured Mewtwo with the Master Ball because I never had the idea of uh, legendary beasts roaming around anywhere. Didn't have that idea, so... Yeah. Oh, God, I really don't want to do this. Oh, God. Whew. Okay, maximum effort. Let's go! Okay, so here we are in the Cerulean Cave, and of course, you will be finding some strong-ass Pokémon. Pokémon well above level 50. And, uh, yeah, just make sure to have a buttload of repels, have Pokemon level above level 60 because you will be getting attacked. Make sure to have somebody that has Rock Smash with them because, yep, look at that, you will be finding some, uh, some different kinds of items right here. On top of that, uh, maybe, just maybe the, these boulders will be on in the way when you're trying to capture Mewtwo. Key ways, you know. And, yeah, make sure to bring a lot of re uh, revives, repels, and healing items because Mewtwo is going to whoop your candy ass from left to right. Now, I liked it back then when, uh, when, when it was just, when it just took a, for a Master Ball to capture Mewtwo. You remember that? Do you guys remember only trying to capture Mewtwo with a Master Ball? When I first played Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, I accidentally used the Master Ball on the Slowpoke. I remember that. Maybe it was like quick, like a quick trigger or something like that. That's probably what happened. But I captured a, uh, I captured a slowpoke with a freaking master ball, and then what proceeded after that was that I tried to go capture Mewtwo, and it did the same thing that it would do if you were going to capture the legendary birds. You kept on missing it with pokeballs and all that stuff. And what made it even worse was the fact that Mewtwo was at level 70, so he's just like some jacked up Pokemon. Kicking all of my Pokemon's ass. Yeah. So that's one big old, uh, one big old story right there. Now, if you guys have a story of your own about your encounters with Mewtwo back when it was just Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, and quite possibly Green, comment down below. I just told you one story right there. I think I have another story. Uh, let's see. I tried capturing it with an Ultra Ball at one point. Yeah. I tried capturing it with an Ultra Ball at one point. And that didn't work out either, because uh, I guess Ultra Balls don't really work uh, on Mewtwo. And then, uh, let's see, there I heard, I have heard of occasions, or I have seen videos, of capturing Mewtwo's uh, with with just one catch. One Pokeball, or one Ultra Ball and stuff. Uh, when it comes, uh, one Pokemon trainer that comes to mind is Luroy. If you guys remember that guy, I seem to remember watching his Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough at one point, and he did capture a Mewtwo with one Pokeball. Was it legitimate? I don't know. I'm not going to question him because he's no longer on YouTube, I think. And, uh, yeah. That was one occasion where I saw that happen. But everything else right here, uh, yeah, Mewtwo, it, I guess in Leaf Green and Fire Red, he became somewhat of a regular Pokemon. And uh, there he is. Wow, we just got, wow, we literally got to him that quickly. Wow. Okay. We're gonna save the game because there's only one Mewtwo! Okay, okay, sweet baby Arceus, please be with us right now. So, the goal is to put him to sleep. 
So I'm gonna go start off with Sir Razor, even though I'm risking the fact that Sir Razor is also a poison type Pokemon. So, oh uh, god. Oh god, I really don't want to do this. I don't. Oh god, okay. Maximum effort. Here we go. Here he is, Mew. Okay. So here he is, all buffed up, looks like Frieza. And uh, yeah, he is, he is at level 70. Now, Mewtwo is by far the strongest Pokemon, regular wild Pokemon or legendary Pokemon uh, that you can actually capture in-game. Someone stronger than Mewtwo would have to be Arceus, but that's just an event Pokemon right there, so don't even try and just like, you know, say that, oh no, it's not Mewtwo. So let's go ahead and put it to sleep, and wow. Just like that, Psychic attack and <laughs> All right, fuck me, huh? Okay, Sir Razor is gone. Okay. Gotta go to plan B. Let's go to Zapdos. Okay, Zapdos, you got all this speed. Use that Thunder Wave, and uh, here is that safeguard. So, what's that supposed to mean? Yeah, so the safeguard is. R okay, so we're gonna use Agility and Crud. Yeah, that Psychic attack is brutal. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, Mewtwo, you are a dick! Okay, let's go, Drago. If he dies, he dies. Thunder Wave. Ah, uh, crud, here we go with another psychic attack. Oh my god, okay. Thunder Wave, come on! <laughs> you suck! Come on! Oh, jeez. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Alright, let's go to our tank Pokemon. You see, he just got done with three of our god dang Pokemon. So, we're gonna be going with Body Slams, and hopefully, it does something. But look at that. Okay. Hopefully, this paralyzes him. Come on. Damn it. Okay. We would have paralyzed him right there. Now, another thing you guys should worry about is that Mewtwo does have Recover, so... That's another move right there that you should be aware of, and uh, as you can see, now it is uh, well within reach. So what I'm going to try and do is, I'm going to have to try and do, actually, you know what? Let's do this. Let's go to Nightmare. It is a Dark-type Pokemon, so it is, uh, yeah, it won't be affected by any of that, oh crud. Yeah, it won't be affected by Psychic, and hopefully Mewtwo will, well, there it is. Use and recover. Oh my god. Okay, so it's recovered, and it's still going to get hurt. Okay. God damn it, Mewtwo. Lexi, Lexi. Um, yeah, I don't have a move that will actually get to it, so what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to revive some Pokemon right here. Uh, let's go with Sir... Well, let's go with Zapdos right here. And uh, here's its swift attack. Uh, damn, okay, so it was a critical hit right there, and I'm gonna try and heal it. Alright, Mewtwo, you asshole Pokemon, you. Getting boofed. And, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go right ahead and use a Hyper Potion onto Zapdos right here. Now, I do have, I do have Tank as well. It's also a beefy Pokemon, so it won't be affected as hard. And luckily for me, I do have Sandstorm right here, so this Pokemon is, uh... Okay, so little by little, he's going down. I can't use Crunch, because that will make Mewtwo faint, so let's go with a Rock Slide, and... Here we go again, another Swift. Not like Taylor Swift, here we go, Rock Slide. Stay, stay, stay. Okay, so there we go. No longer protected by a Safeguard. Now, this is where, this is where it's gonna get... This is where it's going to get really, really risky right here, because Mewtwo has to recover. And if I make it faint before <laughs> before the Sandstorm kills him, then that's pretty much it. So here's an Ultra Ball. God dang it. Yes, it doesn't affect Nightmare. Dude, use freaking Recover. Oh my god. Ah, uh, jeez. Okay, so... <laughs> oh shit, it is at 1 HP. Oh my god. Mewtwo, recover, god damn it! God dang it! Okay. Woo! 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 Okay. Alrighty, so... Okay. 
as Sandstorm's gonna rage. What I need to do right now is I need to paralyze Mewtwo or do something with it. So, come on, Zapdos. Come on, Zapdos. Do not faint on me. Okay, so it's gonna take a few HP. Here's a Sandstorm hitting us both now. Oh, God, okay, come on. And it's not using Safeguard, so... Come on. Come on. Thunder Wave! Okay. Yes! Okay. Thunder Wave, there we go. Alright, you're mine now, P You're mine now, Zapdos. Or, I mean, uh, Mewtwo. You know, I'm probably going to let this Sandstorm just hit it. Um... Uh, yeah, I'm probably going to have to do that. So I'm just going to let the Sandstorm kill Mewtwo. Or not kill Mewtwo, but weaken him. And uh, there's one. God damn it. Okay. And uh, there's that Psychic Attack. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go to the next Pokemon. I'm not going to risk... I'm not going to risk Nightmare just yet. Since Tank is a tank. Yeah, buddy. Alright, let that sandstorm just kick your ass. It it will go away pretty soon. It, yeah, it will go away pretty soon here, so I'm just gonna keep on throwing ultra balls right here. Come on, come on. Stay in the goddamn ball. Freaking Mewtwo. God damn it. Okay. And Swift is going to just hurt it. Okay. Sandstorm, come on. Do me a favor. Alrighty. So we're getting closer right there. I'm just a little scared. Come on. Come on. One. Damn it. Okay. Ah, balls. Okay. So now this ha now now this sandstorm has to go away now. How long is it gonna take? That was probably one of my biggest mistakes right there. I don't know. Okay. Alrighty. Um body slam. Here we go. Stay, 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 stay. Okay. Woo! Yeah, that safeguard's not gonna work for you. Okay, so the sandstorm is probably gonna kill him. So I need to capture this Pokemon right now. And, uh, okay. So he's in the red right now. Let's go. Come on. Ultra Ball. Do me that favor. Come on. God dang it. And there's his most powerful move, Psychic. Uh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Sandstorm hits us both. Nearly makes me faint. Ah, oh, shoot. Come on! Come on! God dang it! Yeah, he's gonna sacrifice himself. Ah, oh, shit. Shits and giggles. Okay, so I gotta go to Godzilla right here. I gotta go with him. Oh my god. Damn it, that Samsor's still raging! Okay, I'm buffed. Mewtwo, you gotta recover, man. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, damn it! Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, so I don't know how long this sandstorm's going to last. Yeah, it's going to last for the remainder of this whole thing, so now... Yeah, I really have to be careful with what I what I choose right here. Let's see. Yeah, that's not going to happen. So I'm just going to throw great balls right here. I'm not going to waste these ultra balls. Come on. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, you're... Okay, so you're recovering, you asshole! Okay, so now, no longer protected, and the sort of sandstorm rages on. Okay, so I can give it one good hit right here, and, uh, okay. Buffed by the sandstorm, this goddamn Mewtwo. Let's go with Flamethrower. Come on. Stay in the goddamn... Oh, shit. Okay. Alrighty. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. The sandstorm's still gonna hit us. I guess it's a, you know, it's gonna stay right there. It's gonna hit us both right here. Crud. Uh, jeez. Okay, so here we go. You know what? Speed button. 
Oh, nearly. God dang it. Speed button. Buff. Come on. Oh, fuck. Alright, so. You know what? Uh, that will actually. If he's gonna do that, then I'm gonna have to do that too. Let's recover. Can't move. Buff, buff. And you know what? Let's go ahead and revive a few Pokemon. Okay, so we're back to square one. Let's go with a Drago. And that one right there is killing me. So what I'm going to do now is i got to heal my Pokemon. Let's go with the speed button right there. And uh, safeguard is... Okay, let's go with Dragon Claw. That nearly kills him! Good God! Okay, so... Oh my God! Here we go, Ultra Ball. Yes! Oh my God! And I had to use the speed button. <laughs> Alrighty! Look at this guy right here! Oh my God! <laughs> So, I managed to capture Mewtwo on a speed button tangent. Oh my god. But it's okay. Here we have the number 150th Pokemon Mewtwo. The genetic Pokemon. It's about 6 feet tall. 269 pounds. Pretty solid muscle right there. It was created by a scientist after years of uh, horrific gene splicing and DNA engineering experiments. Yeah, this Pokemon right here is a... Uh... Oh my god. And will I give this Pokemon a nickname? I don't think so. Mewtwo is a badass Pokemon, and I don't think it needs a nickname. Now, I kind of am tempted. Uh, eh, you know what? Screw it. I'm going to nickname him something. Screw it. Let's name him Frieza. How do you spell Frieza? Actually, hold on. Hold on! Hold on just a sec, guys. Uh, let's go right here, right here, right here, right here, right here. Okay, free. Oh, okay, that's how you spell it. My bad. <laughs> okay, here we go. Free Za. Just because you kind of look like them. So there we go. Frieza has been sent to the PC. Oh my god, I can't believe we captured him just like that. Okay. So, let's just move on and, uh, you know what, let's just go and get, it and get the rest of the items right here. I think I got enough, enough max repels to get, out, get around right here. Yeah, let's see, okay, so, wow, can't believe I captured him after all that. Very good strategy, I mean, the only thing that I was afraid of was uh, Tyranitar's uh, Sandstream and all that stuff, so, yeah, that right there was a... Uh, that right there was pretty scary, so glad it didn't kill him, and uh, glad that Frieza or Mewtwo actually used a uh, used recover quite a few times. So let's see, where are we? Right here. Okay, so let's see, where where are we going? I don't have an escape rope, so now I'm gonna have to like find my way back out. Let's see, you know what? We could go right here. No. Oh, wait, you know what? This is the place, yeah. This is the reason why you need a Pokemon with uh, Rock Smash, guys, because, uh, again, there's going to be areas where you can't, uh, there's going to be some areas where you can't go through without that, that move, so here we go again. There we go. And nothing. Okay, so that right there was probably a dead end. I probably should go back up and... Yeah, okay. Let's see, where are we? Where the hell are we? Right here. And uh, now we gotta go right here. Damn. Mewtwo, why are you so scary? Hey, you know what? Let's see, right here. And uh, let's see, let's go right here. I think you can find some, some extra Pokemon right here. Let's see. We have a Nugget. And uh, let's see. Okay, we could go right here. There we go. And, uh, let's see. Dead end. Okay, you know what? Screw it. We are done. I think. I don't know. Yeah, we are done. 
Okay, so let's just move on right here and uh, get the F out of here because we got Mewtwo. Yeah, we did. <laughs> Alrighty, so that was pretty much it for Mewtwo. And uh, did we ever battle this trainer? No, yeah, we did. Okay, so. Uh, Lexi. Um, yeah. So we defeated Mewtwo, or not defeated him, we just captured him and all that stuff, and now, that is pretty much it right there, guys. So the last thing that we need to do now is go straight to the Elite Four. I think I know what kind of team I'm going to be using. I don't know if it's going to be the popular one, a popular one or whatever, but there's going to be some Pokemon that you haven't seen and you've seen and all that stuff. So I will be back for another episode for the final episode of our Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough, so... Again, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode.